Hello YouTubers. Well, Triumph Open Weekend is finally here and I'm heading over to Jack Lily. And if you saw my last video, uh, you saw that I bought a GoPro to stick down here in the um, windscreen. However, it's not there. <laughs> and uh, you can't see anything down in the corner of the screen here looking back at me. However, 321, there. Slightly different perspective than I was uh, intending because the camera couldn't fit in the screen here with its housing. So at the moment, I've got it in my uh, mobile phone holder, uh, and we'll see uh, see what that's like. So hello, lots of traffic. Wonder what's going on here. Let's get over here and do some filtering. Uh, unless something interesting happens on the motorway, I'll. Uh, I'll catch you a little bit later on. And once again, who would uh, who would be travelling around in a car like this? This is just mental. When it comes to filtering, especially on uh, on motorways, there are a number of uh, particular problems that you face. I mean, apart from the uh, apart from the obvious ones of all of the uh, traffic being a bit uh, silly, is that this space between the lanes of traffic is the most awful piece of road because when they're when they're surfacing motorways they do them in strips corresponding to the lanes and I don't know if you can work out from the video the edges and in general uh, you might be able to see from this one here the edges they correspond with the uh, the lane markings and the edges are the most um, vulnerable part of the road surface so it's where it's uh, most likely to be damaged and also I don't know if you can make out this series of little uh, potholes along the road there uh, that's where they've removed uh, previous white lines and they develop into uh, into potholes and they're usually either on or very close to the new uh, lane markings and then of course you've got the cat's eyes so all of, all of these things combined make the conditions here between the lanes the worst. Now here, actually, you can see that the uh, the surface is a bit more even, or you might be able to see. So, um, so yeah, just uh, thank you. Just things that you need to watch out when you're uh, when you're filtering, and it's uh, it's fairly similar for. Uh, standard dual carriageways as well, uh, multi-lane, multi-lane roads. I hate any form of big dual carriageway. They're just boring, 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 boring. I mean, if you're driven by speed and you don't care about losing your license, then I suppose they're great. But I. If I was interested in speed, I'd be going to track days. But 
plenty of these car drivers, don't care. There you go, see, didn't make any difference to Dick. Let's actually sneak. front, we see, you don't have to go crazy, here we go, Jack Lollies, can you smell those burgers, right let's see if we can, uh, if we can park somewhere, Yeah, that's a that's a very good idea. It's, uh... Oh, I can smell those burgers actually. Oh, actually, ah! I'm making a pig's ear of this. So already quite a quite a lot of people here. Uh, we finished with you. So there we go, lots of uh, lots of bikes, lots of bikes. Let's see what's going on. Okay, I think that'll be that'll be fine like that. Okay, let's have a quick look around, and then I'll put my uh, my camera on charge for later on. So here we go, barbecue, coffees, teas, lots of lots of bikes. I'm guessing there's a lot of people uh, inside. They got a pit stop challenge. So this is going to be uh, fastest wheel change. And the showroom's pretty, pretty full as well. Right. Okay. Well, that'll do for the moment. And I'll pick up a bit more later on. Right. Here we are. Triumph Open Weekend. Well, hey. Okay, so that was uh, Jack Lilly on Triumph Open Weekend and um, now I'm going to go for a ride. The temperature is supposed to be about 30. Okay. Over 30. Which, for those of you running on old money that's um, that's about 90 so it's pretty darn hot so let's go for a nice jolly ride in the countryside put the GoPro through its paces hello everyone and see what today brings now, uh, while I was there, I knew that um, I knew that there was going to be clothing at twenty percent discount. Is it twenty or twenty-five? Twenty, I think. Yeah. 
and I was pleased to discover that that went to uh, luggage as well so I bought myself a new rucksack a new 30 litre Triumph Krieger R30 which normally uh, normally I think that would be 135 pounds and I bought another bag as well a, um, a waste bag, bum bag if you like uh, I can't remember what that would, that cost but the two together cost 138 pounds so effectively that smaller bag was free really and um, well can't say further than that had two burgers so I'm feeling a little bit fat now off out for a, a nice little ride the GoPro is actually saying it's claiming that it's got three and three quarter hours worth of battery life left yeah so when I first uh, first turned the GoPro on and started using it it was claiming that it was going to last four and a half hours on this battery which is pretty good to be honest and let's uh, go past this one much nicer when you've got a, a an empty road ahead of you the reservoir looks fairly full big tractor Woof. I suddenly got a hankering oi suddenly got a hankering for ice cream then come on uh, yeah as I was saying ice cream ice cream ice cream where can I stop and get an ice cream hmm does anyone know uh, if you do know shout out we'll just be on the lookout so if you if you see somewhere as we're traveling along shout out let me know and then i'll stop and have an ice cream okay hello uh, right what's this let's see i think this is where i want to go Little fun. Yeah, let's go up here. Oh, I know where I am. Yeah, 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 yeah. If I find out that you lot saw some ice cream and didn't tell me, I'm going to be quite cross, you know. Little Chalfont. Oh, little tiny Chalfont. Bless. Oh, there's a flood. Flood warning, everybody. Here it is. Because there's the other sign. Whew. Oh, that was a terrible flood there. Oh really fearful for, for going through that lots of big houses around here lots of massive houses and some ordinary houses wow this 
these houses are really big. Oh, library open day. Oh dear, oh dear, you knew you did wrong, didn't you? Okay, there must be somewhere to get a uh, an ice cream here. So I am going to go in here. Right, let's see if I can find somewhere to uh, to park. This looks good. in here right well that was a a very welcome stop for uh, for an ice cream I had a magnum double caramel double bloody caramel yes indeed the Baron would be proud Traffic. Not fair. Gap, 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 gap. Indicate, mirror, go. What a pleasant day out. What time is it? It's uh, 20 past one. So. I'm going to um, pull all this video together, see if I can quickly get a video out of it and upload, recharge the battery in my camera, cameras, <laughs> and then, um, well, see what we're going to do this evening. Oh, right, well I'm... Uh, I'm a bit hot and sticky as well, I could do with a shower too. So, But that's it for today. Uh, what a glorious day. Uh, well, the day is still young actually. But for the moment, for this video anyway, that's it. So as always, ride safe, take care, and I'll catch you next time. Bye for now. <laughs>